today at Rappahannock Community College with our EMS class. And we're doing today, Dad, we're putting together everything they've learned this year, how to treat patients. So what we've done here, we've simulated a motor vehicle accident. So all the skills they've learned as far as trauma, care, patient assessment, things like that, is being put to the test here as we go. What we see here is we've got a motor vehicle accident with two vehicles involved. We're going to have, we've got a baby in one vehicle, so we can do that. We've got some children, mannequins around. Most of our patients are going to be mannequins. And we have one live patient as a driver in there. I guess when we, how are we going to, if we have two people with a, to need the KEV. Watch your backs, watch your backs. Put her down on the ground. Watch Jen's back. <laughs> okay. Start CPR on her. Uh, one of you guys, okay, you got the bag valve mask. Morgan, continue bag valve mask. Uh, Aaron, start an oxygen uh, liter thing at 15 liters a minute. Okay, finally. All right, continue on. Back to where you are. Incident commander, helicopter. We'll miss this one. They've got the They've got the board. You help bring her out. Someone grab C spine. Use the, don't try and grab underneath. You're, you're not going to blow a belt out. You're not going to blow off the all right. Someone's count ready. You're gonna have to get some more weight on this one. Yeah. Go down, scoot now down. hand it out. Work it out. Yep. Yeah, just just guys, let's lay this in. No, no, we got out of the way. Get out of their way. Yeah. I'm completely out. All right. Now. Go down. Keep, no. keep walking. Keep, keep walking. walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Stretch her for all. Bring her down and stretch. Wow. All right. Spiders. Spider. Don't worry about the spider. So what you just saw is we gave we threw some problems at them that are very uh, very complicated. They're not going to do it perfect the first time. There's crews have been doing this for years that don't do it right the first time. When you get a mass casualty, multiple patients on board, it really really confuses things. But this is the way to learn. If they can fix it here in the classroom. They can fix it in real life, and that's the whole purpose of what we're doing here is trying to get them to understand what real life is about and try and fix the problems when they can.